Being high and alone is something I like, but you know what isn't? Addiction. And if you're watching this video, there's a 99% probability that we share the same addiction. And that's short form content. I go on these johns just about every non-consciously waking moment of my life. So this particular night of me being high and alone served to free me of this terrible addiction because every time I opened short form content throughout the night, I made myself eat an extra edible in an act of hopeful stopping my addiction but it only kind of worked here's what happened right off rip after eating this gummy i cleaned my entire house i was an unstoppable force of cleanliness off these gummies but afterward i quickly went back to my addiction not youtube shorts i mean gambling this is gonna be huge i'm gonna open a freaking case dude holy crap Oh, all right. But I felt that if I was to truly free myself of addiction, I probably shouldn't make exceptions. So I ate another gummy after this as well. Then I instantly opened Snapchat and went onto the shorts because I'm not very smart, which meant another one down the hatch. I had already eaten three gummies, so I knew I needed a foolproof strategy that would ensure I wouldn't watch any more shorts. I decided to attack the problem at its roots, which is my attention span. I needed a way to fully reset my mind and my idea to do so was a kind of strange approach in hindsight the plan was to sit down in an empty room and just exist with myself and my drywall i sat there and stared at drywall with as much mental focus as i could possibly exert for as long as i could i would start to feel my focus wavering periodically the only thing this ended up actually accomplishing though was giving myself a headache which is ironically exactly what YouTube shorts do as well. All right, so the drywall strat, it's not working. Maybe I just watch full length YouTube videos instead maybe that will fix me this was a worse idea than the drywall the youtube app did that thing where it opens into shorts so i start watching a handful of these before realizing what i've done i ate another edible but to be honest youtube shorts had admittedly fed me some interesting slop this time around i was watching a big strong shirtless hot man climb a boulder which got me in a real mood to watch more men climbing rocks i was relentless with the men rock climbing videos i watched Olympic climbing. I watched little men climbing. I watched big men climbing. All this climbing made me want to climb myself. So I bought a membership at a climbing gym. I haven't used it yet, but eventually whenever I do, I bet it'll be pretty cool. In an attempt to feel the triumphant victory of climbing rocks, I ended up climbing onto my bed from the floor, which isn't as impressive, but I thought it was pretty cool. Then out of left field, YouTube recommendation threw a real curveball at me. Teen Titans Go Movie magic this video hit the spot like nothing before this show is just so goaded i was watching it so involved and entranced by the funniness and bright colors although i was really lost in the plot here i didn't realize this while i was high but this is actually like five videos strung together into one somehow i still managed to follow some kind of plot despite there not being one which is something quite impressive but this whole time i couldn't stop thinking about how funny robin was this dude has to be the best written character of the millennium. I really came to realize the delicate intricacies of his character here. The only downside of this show is that it's bright and fast and really cool. Just like everything else, it was bad for my attention span. I needed to find some other method to fix myself. I search on Google how to slow attention span and find this article. After reading it at the end, they recommend behavior therapy, which I don't need. So the article was shit and it didn't help me at all. Considering that the other things in this article were chewing gum and drinking water, I came to realize after reading this that I'm actually doing everything perfectly and optimally for fixing my attention span, if that's really all it takes. I guess I'm just left to live in torment and evil constantly. Afterward, I went down a massive YouTube rabbit hole, so I'll just give you some of the good ones before I went bye-bye sleep time for the night. And trust me, the last one will change something in you. So I watched how to turn a lego man into meth then i watched pirate videos about how to be pirates those ones were pretty sweet i learned how to become the pope i watched this video and legitimately did not listen to one word for the entire 30 minutes i watched for an hour about the napoleonic wars i've never given a squat about history at all in my life so i don't know why i watched this
this, but it was interesting. I found out how to board an airplane. Then I watched a ton of these kid gaming videos and they went so hard. But the biggest video I watched was this one. This video is something special. Anyways, subscribe.